Hello guys. So in this session, we are going to learn how to install Sonar Cube on Windows. So here we are going to install Sonar Cube on Windows, so the latest version of Sonar Cube. So we are going to see the version of Sonar Cube. Okay. So let's start to install Sonar Cube on Windows. So first of all, we need to understand what is Sonar Cube. So Sonar Cube is a code quality assurance tool that collects and analyzes source code and provides reports for the code quality of your project. Okay, so, so that's the short information about Sonar Cube. Okay, so let's start to install Sonar Cube on Windows. So for that, first of all, you need a Sonar Cube server. It requires Java version 17. Otherwise, you can install higher version of 17. But we need to install Java 17, okay. Then Sonar Cube server requires at least 2 GB of RAM to run efficiently and 1 GB of free RAM for the operating system, okay. That's the prerequisites to install Sonar Cube on Windows, okay. So as you can see, here I have launched the instance, well, sorry, Windows instance, and I have successfully connected to my instance. You can see this is my Windows operating system instance. You can see host name, instance ID, private IP for address, public IP for address, instance size. I am going to use t3.medium because of smooth performance, right? And the availability zone is AP South 1B architecture and total memory and network of 5 gigabit. Okay. So that's the my Ubuntu, sorry, Windows instance. Okay. So Let's start. So, as I told you here, we, we are going to learn how to install Sonar Cube. Oh, okay. So here we are going to use. Uh, we are going to download the latest Sonar Cube on Windows. Okay. So let's see the version. So let's go to this Windows instance and let's open the Microsoft page. So as you can see, this is the Sonar Cube or official documentation. You can see right the reviews and so on the details, and you can see the latest version of this Sonar Cube, right? Twenty two. Okay, as you can see, the latest version of this Sonar Cube that two thousand twenty five point one LTA. Otherwise, you can use this also. This also, right? That's the latest version of Sonar Cube. Okay. So now we are going to install this latest so version of Sonar Cube on this Windows instance. Okay, so let's start. So for that, first of all, you can see. So let's start. So the first step is we need to download and install Oracle Java 17 on Windows. So as I told you, if you want to install Sonar Cube on Windows, first of all, you need to install Java. So here we are going to use Java 17. So for install Sonar Cube, the we need Java 17. Okay. So let's go to the official site of this. So let's open this official site of Java. Install Java. So as you can see, Java SC 17 are show downloads. Let's scroll down. And in last, you can see Windows. 64 MSI installer, we need to install this. Okay, let's go to the download. And as you can see, JDK 17. Okay, so let's install. Double click, preparing to install. Click on welcome to the installation. Next. Click on next. So as you can see, Java 17, it's installing. As you can see, it's done. Successfully installed. Okay, now click on close. It's done. So we have successfully installed Java on this. If you want to confirm, then you can open the command prompt. Enter CMD. 
and here simply run java hyphen version as you can see java version and so on the details of it because you have successfully installed java on this windows operating system okay okay now let's check the next step now it's done right okay after the next step is let's download and install the sonar cube on windows okay so let's go to the official site and download the latest version of sonar cube okay so let's go to the official sonar cube site you can see this is the official sonar cube documentation you can see the overviews and so on the details of this you can see the installation requirements okay then pre-installation steps for linux and so on the operating system side then introduction then install the database and so on let's install the zip file so click on it okay after that you will have this page installing the from the zip file and here as you can see download the distribution okay so let's click on it after that you will have this page okay now click on community bit you can see there is a four option developer edition enterprise edition data center edition so on the details okay so here we are going to install this free open source for productivity and code quality this is download for free so click on it and here if you want to subscribe means enter your email then you can enter otherwise you can skip it also as you can see download community build and you can see here our sonar cube is now downloading okay it's done let's go to the download you can see this is our zip file that we have successfully downloaded. now we need to unzip this so click on right click and click on extract all and if you want to extract this another location you can then you can set location here but i want to go this here so I click on extract now as you can see it's extracting our sonar cube zip folder okay it's done right if you go to this you can see this is a zip file this is unzip file right this inside this this is our sonar cube that we have successfully unzip okay now after that if i go to this c drive and go to program files and here you can see the java jdk 17 bin so here we have successfully set our path okay okay now now the next step is let's start sonar cube on windows so how to start so first of all let's go to the unzip file sonar cube and here let's go to the bin folder after that you will have this page like that windows and linux mac os and so on the details here our operating system is windows so let's go to the windows after that you can see sonar start okay there is two options two way to start sonar cube on windows how first option this and the second one is open command prompt and you need to set the location of this so so start sonar okay our location is you can see first of all you need to go to the download inside this folder then inside then let's be inside the bin folder then inside this windows folder and then start inside this folder okay after that you can enter start sonar.bat okay and the other option is just click or right click and click on run as administrator after that you will have the page like that that command prompt starting sonar cube so we need to wait few seconds that means 10 seconds maximum as you can see 
it's waiting for elastic search to be up and running mm -hmm. So as you can see, it's running, right? You can see. So you can see it's up, right? Is up, okay? So now our sonar cube is running, okay? So let's. So how do I access sonar cube in browser? So simply open your browser and enter. local host colon and the sonar cube port number is 9000 for all operating system right now you can see it's loading sonar cube server sonar cube is starting and if you open this your command prompt you can see start common login okay you can see sonar cube is starting as you know, we need to wait for a few seconds to starting our sonar cube. So it's almost ready. It takes few seconds to start Sonar Cube, right? So just a second. Starting our sonar cube. And you can see now it's in login page, right? Login to sonar cube. So as you know how to log in sonar cube. So the default login and that means username and password is admin, right? So let's enter a login. Admin and password also admin as you can see. Okay, click on login. After that, you need to update your password. Last old password is admin. Enter a new password. So as you can see, the you can see though your password must be the 12 characters, one upper, one lower, one number, and one special character. So let's enter your career uh, your password. As you can see, we are successfully logged into, so we have successfully accessed our sonar queue, right? So as you can see, it's done. We have successfully accessed sonar cube and we have successfully downloaded sonar cube in our operating uh, Windows operating system, right? So it's done. So in this session, we have learned how to install the latest version of Sonar Cube on Windows. So thank you for watching and I hope you understand.